Hello everybody, it's me Shade from the Royal Variety and I am sitting here sleepy. It's a little after 9 p.m. I am rendering a video. I don't know how to turn this stupid thing around so you could just, you know, I'll just turn my phone around. There, that's what I'm working on. I'm, working, I'm rendering that makeup video I made. I don't know if this will come out before or after it because it's taking forever to render. But, I don't know why that's so damn zoomed in on my face, but it won't let me zoom out. But, I just was starting to mess with something, and I really thought it'd be cool to do a video on it. So, I have this thing. I keep looking at the wrong freaking part of my phone. Anyway, I have this thing. It goes on your phone, and... Basically, it's a magnifying glass, like right there. You know how people say you can do that thing with like the laser pointer, the little like magnifying glass in it. You can attach it to your phone and have like a super zoom. That's what this is. I got it at a yard sale. A couple bucks. Not bad. I figure if it don't work, whatever. So uh, it does work. It's pretty cool. And I figured let's just look at it like skin. But first, I wanted to show you, this is what my hands look like. I have a little bit of, you know, like dirt, kind of like that. Oh. Focus on my hand, stupid. Yeah, it won't focus on my hand because my face is in the way. I'm going to tap it a few times. Oh, well, it's going to be stubborn. But... You know, basically we're going to be looking at that and my fingernails and my palm. Because I've seen some really interesting stuff at the tip of my finger that you can't really notice with the bare eye, not finger. Because we don't see through our finger. So I am going to pop this on over my camera. And we're going to take a look because it does actually do with video too. So, let's see how it works. Now, everything is super blurry right now because it's unmagnified. Let's, okay, you remember that, we'll put it to a clean part of my hand. We'll do, like, that. And that is a close-up of my palm, and it looks like there's little black hairs and glitter just embedded in my skin that there is glitter everywhere in my palm I don't know if this is from the makeup or what but I have washed my hands after I did that video so it's like really weird so ignore that that's the crease in between my hand and my middle finger my bad finger so that's the wrinkle there it looks like my skin is, like, iridescent. That's so weird. Some more, like, little hairs that are in the skin. I also apologize. I probably should have put a warning somewhere that this video might be gross. I don't know if anyone would find this gross. I'm sure somebody will, but... There's no, like, gore or nothing. It's just uh, the skin of my hand. My fingerprint. There's a tip of my finger. We're getting to my nail. Wow. Pull the fingernail. That is just trip. Holy crap. This looks amazing. I haven't actually done this yet. I put it on other objects. Oh, look at my nail. It's like got grooves in it. Oh, look at the nail bed. This really makes you feel like you don't wash your hands good enough. I mean, obviously I don't because I have this spot. I don't know when I did this. But this is a, that one dirt spot that I showed you on the regular camera view. And you can see I got... It looks kind of like little hairs. 
on it. Like a tangle. Honestly, it kind of looks like it's a wound of some kind, but it's not. It's just makeup. There's ridges of my nail. Looks like I need to moisturize. <laughs> So yeah, uh, if you ever want to feel like you don't wash your hands enough, get one of these. Because, ooh, it will tell you that you do not wash your hands well enough. It's, whoops, I tried to get my... It's another fingernail. I got a bit of a hangnail here. Sorry for the slight blur, it is hard to kind of maneuver this. You can see how atrocious my nails are. <laughs> What? This is just, honestly, it's worth the money just to look through and see how magnified everything is. Cause that is cool. There's another hangnail I got. Oh, little sucker. My thumbnail and pull. You can tell I'm pulling the skin there. Come on, zoom. There we go. Get it to cooperate. See, I needed this when I go to take a pic. There was little tiny spiders. <laughs> Boy. Really just kind of makes me want to go wash my hands. Let's do the back of my hand. Maybe it's better. There's a little hair there. I can't even see it. When I pull the camera away, I, I cannot tell it's there. Oh, there's some actual just hairs that are supposed to be there. Let's see if I can't look at my mole. Yep, there's a mole. And some hairs. Guys, this is so cool. You can get like a magnifier or something like this to do. I recommend doing it. It's really cool. There's another mole. They do not look that pleasant up close. Also, I had no idea my skin was so iridescent. See if vein or something shows up decent, or if it's just too close for that. I think it might be too close. But there's, I think that's a vein. Yeah. It's hard to tell. You can see them more clearly uh, with the naked eye than. do my other hand see how my non-dominant hand looks there's a little hair or something I don't know what that is but there's there's some more and I can't even really see these when I just look at my hand they're so small well, there's some makeup I think why these the makeup got back on my hands is because I touched it. My I touched my face after washing my hands, so it got back on my hands. Under your nails looks it looks like it should be painful. I'm gonna be honest. Under your nails does when you look at it close up, it looks like you should just be in constant pain. That is just disturbing. And you could tell my nails chip and I just pull them off. That's my bad habit. I don't bite them, but I do pull them off. And they chip and I just yank. And there's some more hairs. Or whatever they are. I'm just very fascinated with how textured my fingernails are. <laughs> they look so smooth to the naked eye. Some more rough... Cuticles. Got a notch in my nail. I didn't know that was there. I just kind of filed them a little bit ago. Earlier today. There's that. 
Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Some more fuzzies. Oh, there's another thing. That kind of looks like a little scorpion. Huh. I cannot see it with my there eyes. I just moved the phone so I could see and I I can't find it, so. Whoops. Wow, this is a fascinating trip. I need to do some more stuff with this, because it is so cool. Seeing things so close up like this. Maybe I'll do a video on my feet. That'll be... Very interesting and probably disgusting, but that's for another time. For now, I'm going to take this off, and I will see you shortly. Well, that was kind of disturbing. Looks clean, don't it? So, yeah, that's kind of the importance of uh, proper hand wash. <laughs> oh, wow. You don't believe in that? Get you one of these. Actually, I have the box so I can show you what it is in case anybody wants to try it. Now it is a 30X at scope quick attach microscope. That is what it is. As you can see, I got it at a yard sale for two bucks. And it was two bucks very well spent. I gotta try plants sometime. Ooh, and salt. See, we just tried skin. You could do it on salt, plants, and money. Or bugs, if you, you know, you can get them to hold still long enough. But, there he is. If you can read it, it's backwards, so I don't know if it, it's going to pop up backwards in the recording or not, but. The 30X AppScope Quick Attach Microscope, you basically, you flip it you put it on your phone over your camera and unfortunately i do have to zoom in the video because otherwise you get the round circle from this you record the inside of this so you have to zoom a little bit if you don't want that in your video but not really big idea the quality is still okay as you, as you've seen <laughs> but yeah i think we can have some fun with this in a couple more videos, we'll look at other stuff. Maybe learn something together. That could be fun. But, for now, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like it, boop the subscribe, or boop the like button. If you didn't, if you really liked it, boop the subscribe button. Stick around for another cool, science -y like video, because I am a total scientist with my terrible makeup from the earlier video I recorded. I need to wash my face again. Actually, I just want to jump in a hot bath right now because, wow. Wow. So, you have any ideas on what else I can put under this thing and really take a look at it? it has to be something kind of that it can sit flush against. We can, I'll try, yeah, stuff, whatever. But, thank you guys for watching. Let's go wash our hands. <laughs> Bye, guys.